Well, hello everybody, I am Spit and welcome back to episode 21 of my Oxygen Not Included Let's Play series. Where today, um, well, let's slow down so I don't panic too much. Uh, everything's going nice and smoothly over here. I haven't done much, I've just sort of queued up a few little bits and pieces here and there. Um, so we've got to finish off... Uh, there's a puff stuck in there. This is the problem with having so many animals around the base. Um, so what am I doing here? I am relocating this line so it goes this way. Um, so that just in case we need to run something under here. Um, cleaning the last little bit of this up. I've got to put in a heating loop in here because it is much too cold to grow the arbor trees of course. Uh, which will mean that this will melt and we'll have to mop it up, but what can you do? Um, we will need a cooling loop in here because these guys grow at 0 to negative 25. Um, might have been good to have these two swapped perhaps, but it's too late for that now. Um, and I need obviously the cooling loop and the base finish. Now, I can use this loop here. I can bring it up and circulate it around in here as well because I believe arbor acorns can grow. Let's see what temperatures they can grow at. Um, 15 to 40 degrees Celsius. Uh, in here is 43. What temperature? Can I drop this down? Can I drop this temperature down? 35 to 90. So if I drop this down to 35, say, um, that'll bring this up to 35 as well. That seems pretty good to me. Alright. Um, so, let's put in plumbing. Now, obviously, I can't... I'm going to have to have the loop uh, out of the... <laughs> out of this ground here. Now, what I'm also going to do is I'm going to expand this here. Um, that is taking quite a bit of heat out of the water. But then it gets here and it's cold again. Um, I think it's just because it's sitting there, of course, but um, plumbing. Uh, it's still pretty warm down here, so that's okay. Uh, now, cooling loop. We want, uh, we can use lead for this. Uh, so we're going to go all the way across there like that, all the way across there like that, and then we'll just need insulated pipes like that. We'll have to come... Let's see, how will we do this? Uh, come over here like this, and we can take it out this way. So if we continue this on up here, Uh, actually, if we go this way. Uh, then we can go... Across here. Yeah, okay. Alright, that's what we're going to do. We're going to... Snip that. Uh, and then we're going to need... Whoop, like that. Okay. That gets that in there. Um, that way, that way, that way. So that is the way we're coming out, yeah? Yep, we'll come out this way. Um, and then that will come that way. Right. We need another liquid bridge because that was going in the wrong direction. 
that way. Uh, now this one will go out here. And then it can come, I suppose it can be like this, we'll just have to pump more water into it so it's got better power. Uh, now I do need to swap out this liquid in here with something different. The petroleum in here is just fine, uh, but I would like something different in here. But first, let's finish this. So we need to get... Uh, we can come in here. Like that, I think. Um, we will obviously have to... Do something like that. Uh, leave that one for now. Do I actually go like that? Yeah. And then we're gonna snip that there and there. And come this way. Alright, that sounds pretty good to me. Uh, I'll have to let them build that. This goes out this way. Um, and that'll run straight through. Uh, the other thing is I want to move the bathrooms down here. Um, and I need to make a few more toilets. Um, but also... Once this is down at temperature, um, we'll be pretty good, and it won't... Obviously, oh, the ethanol's going to come in pretty warm. Um, 73 degrees. Hmm. Alright, we'll have a think about that. Um... But I'll get them to put all this in. I'm going to jiggle some things around here. And we'll be right back. Uh, let's just check on Harold real quick and make sure that there's nothing that he can work on in the meantime. Um, he'll have to do some sweeping up, I think. He can mop up this. Alright, well I'm going to put make him a nice little junk pile. Right there. We're gonna dig that up. We're gonna put like that and a tile right there. Alright, that's where Harold's junk's gonna go. Alright, I'll be right back. Okay, so I've done a few extra things, got some bonus bedrooms, and we're getting that Draco out of there because. Man, that's annoying. Um, got more of this cooling loop in here. And we will be able to get it to snake its way down here and back up here. Um, where does it go? It comes down here. So we will, yeah, probably snake it around this way and then back up here through to here. Um, I'm replacing this ladder down the middle here with, I've got this one up here. Um, we're moving the bathrooms down here. Uh, now, I will have to, if we have a look here, we're going to have four duplicates on each, uh, you know, on each thing. So I will actually need another bathroom and I think I will put it maybe here. Um, or I could keep this one here, to be honest. It doesn't matter too much. Um, but I would kind of like it closer here. So I'm I'm in a bit of a jam because I've got to finish off all the research before I can remove that. Oh, uh, whoops. Before I can remove this and all that sort of stuff. And I'd like to keep the water pits here. Um, 
So I will be able to expand this bathroom, but for now I suppose we'll just leave this one here. Um, and this one can be... There we go. Excellent. Uh, now, just make sure there's nothing under there. There is not. Uh, now, as you can see, my... Uh, this little box with the details is very different, and that is because someone told me that this mod has been updated and... Oh boy, <laughs> that's uh, that's so much nicer. So I can actually see everything I've got now. Um, but aside from that, we're doing pretty good. I can now reconnect that, I believe. Um, I was moving the output ventilation for these and we were having some tiny little power troubles, but I think that's fixed uh, now. We've got a rocket, which is very good. Uh, now, we want to come back outside the rocket because we need to start pumping oxygen in here, right? So we're just gonna kind of go like this, right? Because uh, that's the easiest way to do this. And then we're literally just going to pinch oxygen off that line there. Um, that seems fine by me. Now the interior in here, let's have a look. Um, that needs deconstructing and I've got to move it over once, once it's gone. Um, the other thing I will need to do is put a storage bin and well, we're we gonna move it over how big is this telescope it's three wide isn't it okay very good so we can put a storage bin right there move this over that'll leave room there um that should be good um so we're gonna have to take resources with us in order to make the telescope and the charging stuff for the telescope yada 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 um, can that be, why is that unreachable? Is it actually unreachable? Yes, it is. All right, so let's speed them back up again, get some of this in. Now this is all getting quite hot in here, so that's why I'm trying to get this cooling loop done, um, a little bit quicker. Uh, which is why I'm trying to get the base finished a little bit quicker. Now this can probably stay like this. Sweep that up. Uh, all of that needs sweeping up, but I can deconstruct this now. And put in my... Water sieve once more. Once someone's done it. Bubbles will come and do it in just a moment. Uh, now, I should open these doors. That will save time. And refinement. Where are we? Water sieve. There. And that'll get that done. Um, is there anything else that needs to be done immediately? Let's check on Harold real quick. Harold is going well. That water's coming out of the petroleum generator, but that's fine. And we're doing good on ethanol. I'm just sort of sneaking this ethanol across. Harold does not have a lot to do. So if I can give him things, then that's nice. He's got a bunch of sweeping to do, of course. Um, probably needs to make a bit more sand. Let me drink bottles in the air, I can't read. Sand. I don't know. Another 500 kilos. What? Oh. What is. Hey. No, 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 no. Wait, really? You worried about that? I do suppose there is asteroids coming in. Um, we'll make this the important bit. 
like that. Uh, now the automation wire here actually needs to be destroyed. And that's pretty important as well. Can they get through that? Well, if not, they can now. Alright, everything seems to be going pretty well, except poor Stinky here can't sleep. Um, same here, buddy. It'll be okay. Um, and aside from that, we are still... Oh my. That's not splitting. This should be okay, I hope, because it's got three layers. We will fix that. We're getting in here for the Mercury, of course. It's it's an okay coolant liquid, so the thermal conductivity is fantastic. It will take heat out of there like nobody's business. The specific heat capacity, however, is kind of whatever. Um, so, like, petroleum up here. Wait, I have petroleum right there. Um, petroleum is great for, like, cooling, like, for dumping heat into for the metal refineries, um, because it's specific heat, like, these are a lot better, but for actual cooling loops, I understand that, uh, it's just like, is that? By any, oh, it's radioactive. <laughs> I was gonna say, don't don't tempt me. Although crude oil is actually really good on both of them. Like it takes a lot to get it hot. Um, but polluted water over here has like these numbers matter. Um, I saw someone talking about it earlier today. Someone please sweep that up. Um, well, things are going very well in here. Can no one reach that? Do not destruct, deconstruct that one yet. Alright, well, I'm going to leave these guys to it and let them build a bit. That needs deconstructing. Uh, send green signal if below 8. Thank you. There we go. Things are going well. Uh, and I'm getting, obviously, the warming loop up here for this. And I did change the temperature of this, didn't I? Yes, 35 degrees. And we need... We will need a cooling loop in here, of course. Um, but that will be for later. Now, what I could do, because these will produce quite a bit of heat, I could take heat out of here and put it in here. But I don't think these things get hotter than 75 degrees like I think they only get up to 75 degrees I don't know we'll find out uh, now we will need a tile right there like that yes that's fine Is someone actually going to deconstruct that? They can't reach it. Can they genuinely really not reach that? Like, for realsies not reach that? I just... I don't know, that feels kind of silly. What if I... Really? That just, I don't know, feels really silly that they can't reach that. Like, they can't stand in the door and get it? Like, and this is why we need the cooling loop in. They're just using lead on repairing this, and ugh. part of it is because this water is not circulating. Um, but... Right now, I can't do much about that, and I actually need to disconnect that from there temporarily. Um, they cannot reach that, so we will need ladders. And how is overall this temperature going? Pretty well, and uh, that's not cold enough. Yeah, the base is getting kind of warm. 
but oh well. Um, and another little shine bug statue. Very nice. Uh, now they can deconstruct that and sweep everything up. Uh, so we can move this ceiling down one here, and that will give us extra space in here as well. Um, oh, that noise is disgusting. <laughs> okay, Harold. Harold, how you going? Sweeping, but that's fine. Sweeping is good. Uh, there's nothing alarming going on here. Yeah, look, I think you're just gonna hang out for a bit. Uh, you can probably dig those two up. Cancel that one. Now you can dig that one up. Um, Alright, let's come back in here. We need a rocket control station like that. Duplicate operation required, that's fine. Uh, we're going to come back out here and come back up here to the thingamajigs. Uh, we can dig those two out, please. Aha. Nope, they're just... Someone will be in here. There we go. Hello, Stinky. Why didn't you use all that copper ore on the ground? Buddy? Alright, excellent. Now... I will also, whilst I'm here, rocketry, telescope, like that. Can I deconstruct that whilst we're out in space, or should I actually cancel that one? Should I put this one, like, up here, right? It's a shame that doesn't fit in there. Uh, we'll have to come back to that, but we need this here, um, built pretty quickly. Stinky's coming to do it again, uh, but we do have printables first. Nine strength is pretty good. Do we take Ruby? We're skating by on food. Uh, no, we'll take the rust. Just for now. Yeah, I think that's fine. Alright, last thing to do whilst they're all running around like... Actually, come back in here is what we do. Uh, now we will pump this thing full, of course, of... Uh, oxygen. And sweep that and that up. That's good, 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 good. Alright. Things are going nicely. That looks exactly like... Bear with me here. A dash of salt vine scene. Uh, or is it just me? Um, excuse me? Why do you do that? Oh, the table salt was right there. And they've just taken it away. Guys, don't leave food on the ground. Uh, and also, disable that. Ellie's asleep. That's okay. That's our clothing bin. Alright, things are going good. Very good. And let's check in here. So now we get to add metal ore... Just like a bunch of copper, and we also want something like ooh, igneous rock. Someone please bring a bunch of stuff. So we're just going to have to build stuff like whilst they're out in space, and I think that's pretty fine. That's not looking too bad. Once we're done with all the research, I can put the monument here, perhaps. I was thinking of putting it here before I put the beds in. Hmm. Things to consider, hey? How big is that? 20 ton. 
That's pretty good. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Man, I just... Oh, I can't believe it. <laughs> What is that flicking back and forth? Is it turning? Oh, the... I think what it is is that the... Copper on... Is that... No, it's liquid salt. But I think there's liquid copper there that's constantly... Flashing back and forth. <gasps> oh, how, how radioactive is that? Not very. Okay. Man, no. This is just what I have to deal with now. I just, oh, I desperately hope this doesn't split. It shouldn't. It really shouldn't, if it hasn't yet. I made sure to block this up good and proper. How did steam get in there? Hmm. Nope. I don't want to know. Do I put tiles here? Um... I'm gonna be very silly and say no. How's this? These are going okay. Yeah, 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 that's fine. That abyss light's busting. Yeah. Yeah. Uncomfortable. But there's barely any rock gas in there. You'd think it'd flow up to here. Um, now, I will need someone. Uh not Harold, someone on this planet, to dig. Congratulations, Hassan. Please come down here and dig this. <laughs> Question, where did that all come from? That's a fair bit of hydrogen, you know. That that's a decent, respectable amount of hydrogen. I know. Mm, no. What about hydrogen? Hmm. I heard somewhere that helium's a better insulator, or like a better, better for buffering heat than hydrogen is. I don't know. Maybe I'm wrong. Be worth experimenting with. I also did promise, um, and the reason why I'm recording like this rather than getting stuff done is because I spent way too long today cutting out little bits of paper to make a paper magpie, but um, I heard that this stuff is basically either hydrogen or natural gas and you can just burn it as it is in, like this here says it's just hydrogen, right? So maybe I can just burn it straight up? I'm definitely gonna try it, like, it'd be worth it. Uh, now, can we auto wrangle surplus and set that at zero? I want to see if they can catch some mobs. Catalina can indeed wrangle mobs from there, that's nice to know. Um, we're just going to turn that off for now, uh, and not worry about it. Ah, uh, it's a mesh tile, that's, that's okay. Alright, let's see where we're going with this now. So we get to run this down here. Uh, that can be like that. And across here, you reckon? Across here with the lead. And then we can run it... Well, I mean, we've got to get back up here somehow. So if we go to there, and then we choose the igneous rock pipe. Ooh, no, not like that. Uh, now. This is not going to stay here, this ladder, but I'm also going to uh, move that ceiling down one, so that can go across there, and then that, 
as a matter of fact, let's make that out of lead. This can get deconstructed. And we want to wiggle our way back around here, don't we? Let's deconstruct that. Deconstruct that. I am going to indeed make the bathroom right here. Uh, this can be deconstructed and moved to there. That can be deconstructed. We want this across here. We want to deconstruct uh, buildings like that. And then we want to go back to the plumbing. Uh, this can also be deconstructed and we want these air <laughs> That was so brutal. Oh, I'm so sorry, that was pretty funny though. Um, we can deconstruct these though. Uh, that's gonna have to go, that's gonna have to go. That one's gonna have to go. All of this plumbing is gonna have to go. Um, that crown molding is gonna have to go, as are those. Okay, that's a big lump of gold. Um, now, back to the plumbing. So this here, all of this is gonna go, of course. Um, this is going to have to come up here. We're expanding the bathroom right now, so we're going to put extra toilets in here. So there's one there. And we'll need in total four, right? Because we need... I'd like one for each duplicate. So we're going to need... Uh, look, let's just get... Okay, bathroom. That's gone. Um, that can be deconstructed. Right. Uh, this one can be cancelled. We're cancelled. And we can move that over to there. That can be deconstructed. We can put the ladder down there. Right. We can deconstruct this ladder. Uh, and once this is full of morbs, remember, I'm going to seal this up. Which is nice. So really we can have... That's also going to need to be deconstructed because we're going to have two sinks. One, two, three, four baths. And then two sinks like that. Seems fair. And then we're going to move it all over one. Uh, that also means that, that cooling loop can't go there. Um, things to consider. It means that this has to go there. That can get deconstructed. Uh, That can go there. That's going to get deconstructed. Uh, let's slow them down so I can think and... It'd also be nice if it turned daytime already because the dim light does not do my brain very well. Um, now, this obviously... Uh, sink, sink. Toilet, toilet. Gap, toilet toilet and then sink sink exit okay toilet toilet sink sink all right and then plumbing cancel all of that Output, 
Output. Output. Alright, get moving guys. That's all good. Cancel that one. Uh, well then I suppose that's just gonna... Go like that. And really can go like that. That's fine, I think. Um, as soon as that is empty, which will hopefully be a bit quicker, please, I want it to be all gone. It just means I can snip this. <laughs> Actually, this is coming up here, isn't it? Um, now, if all this is going to go... This is going to have to go here. Uh, we will want one of these statues. Oh, look at that. Oh, yeah. E. <laughs> yeah, that's pretty good, though. Yikes. Whew. Oh, boy. What's in here like? Ugh, oh, yikes. Okay, let's not even think about that. Let's get them to build all this stuff up. Um, now this is of course still dropping stuff. No, it's no longer doing that. That's excellent. Well, we can put those two there. That's getting deconstructed, like now. That's our conveyor chute just dropping everything in there. Which I might actually move over. Delete all of that. Delete that one. Can they reach that? Don't delete these yet. Um, now we will need, of course, two like that and a door. And we want crown molding. Uh, can I not put- oh, of course, because there's no wall there. Uh, put them there for now. Oh yeah, cool little hatch guy. Uh, now this can be all not critter eggs and not seeds. My drink bottle's in the way again. And not clothing. Good. Alright. Uh, now this needs to get put down here. Why does that make that sound? And this can go here. Power. That can get destroyed. Alright, we'll let them, as a matter of fact, you can destroy all of them. A uh, bunch of that can be swept up. Now that does mean that there's no power to this, but I am certain it will survive. Alright, how is in here going? Oh, we got heaps. Okay, that can be deconstructed. We don't want anything in there. That needs to be built, because we are going to pump oxygen in here. Very nice. Does it smell like flowers somewhere out there? I suppose so. They're getting there. They're doing their best. Um, now, so, water's going to come back in here. It's coming out here, around, 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 around this way, around this way, to here. You know what? Uh, that is the wrong way to go about it plumbing. It needs to come up here. Although I suppose if that plumbing there is going to go, then it can come back this way, back up here. Because it's got to get in here, right? What's this from? That is for this loop. Oh man. That's fine. 
Um, we do need that. Um, that's actually pretty okay, because this is all very even temperatured. Um, Alright, let them keep going. I've changed my mind that is indeed going to keep coming this way. Like that. Hopefully this will get done nice and quick. I think we will use this here as the cooling f uh, the water for this and then we can have our chlorine chamber like right here. Someone sweep please. This is all getting pretty chilly in here. Like look at that, 109. Those can be swept, those can be swept. It's just critter central in here though. Ooh. Uh, nah, I, I don't. I don't particularly care about any of them. Ah, uh, not the sweet leg. Oh, goodbye, little guy. Uh, now of course. Excuse me, I said no clothing. Why is there an Atmos suit in there? Why is that in there? Okay, get, get that Atmo suit up there. Guys, come on. Uh, now of course ventilation's gonna have to take a little... Whoop. Like that or something. Uh, but aside from that, that's doing pretty well. Harold. Uh, wait, how's in here? Not quite there yet. Harold, how you going? Are you bored? Are you still tidying? He's still cleaning stuff up. He just keeps mopping this bit. Oh, of course. Um, you know, look, don't mop that up. Um, we're gonna dig these two, and you're gonna build mesh tiles there. In fact, don't even do that yet. It's just dripping down from here. Um, and those jumbo batteries can be deconstructed. Alright. We just need to get ventilation. All this done. And honest, honestly guys, guys please, can you really not get in there? I just... I just think that's very unreasonable. Well look, let's get the um, stuff in there first, the oxygen in there first. Oh, I have so many fish. Um, now can I, am I at the point now where I can tell them that you're not allowed to eat Barbecue. Um, no barbecue, no cooked fish, but if you let the guy do it, he can cook you this stuff. Yeah. Now, why is that disabled? Yeah, because that's, uh,. We're just gonna deconstruct that for now. Alright, very good. How delightful. Very good. There's of course all those mobs in there. The mobs. Hey. That's forbidden. 
It's you're not wasting your time. <laughs> I'm not having you guys waste your time in such a frivolous and ridiculous matter. All right, there. Problem solved. That's pretty toasty, but what can I do right now? Three more. <clears throat> that means I'll need three more bedrooms somewhere. Now these are going away. Uh, left only. Um, but I think I might have to call it there for now. Um, let's get the oxygen up in here. Yeah, let's get oxygen up in here first. Uh, and then I'm going to call it quits. You can't reach that either. What if we dig all that out? Actually, don't dig that bit out. Dig that bit out. Oh yeah, that's what that's for. Uh... Yeah, look, I'll, I'll accept that, but Harold's doing fine on food. He's got this up here, um, he can occasionally pick up free fish fillets, or fillet, as I'm aware Americans call it. Go figure. Fillet. <sighs> um... My main concern, of course, is that he might run out of water sooner or later. I mean, he will. Alright. Uh, conductive wire. That's going to get built. Okay. View interior. This is going to get chock-a-block full of 20 kilograms of oxygen per tile, which will be enough for what they need, 100 gram a second. 100 gram or 50? Hey, bubbles. Bubbles. Come back here. Breath. Uh, bio. You're so old. <gasps> really? You're one of the younger Jew. Oh, wow. <laughs> Hey look, I haven't lost one yet. I am... Look, I just... Uh, Alright, let's, let's just see. Duplicants, where are they? They're not under... I was going to say, they're not under critters, are they? Duplicant... Nope. I think it's 100 gram a second, right? Uh oh. Wasn't that terrible? Um, so. We are going to put in a liquid bridge right there and say that is very important to do. So that we can at least get the water out of here before it all freezes. <laughs> um, and then we're just gonna gently suggests that the water doesn't go up there anymore. Hey, look at that! They've got some nice food. Yeah, okay, that's good. Excellent. Well, that'll be a bit more efficient on our food. Very good. Okay. Uh, now we've got oxygen up in here, don't we? Um, look, let's let's just dig this out, deconstruct these, dig that out. Let's just do this, and let's see real quick down the bottom. Cheaper is Mister. How did? Now I genuinely... Oh, it got pumped in there. Okay, I, that's that's fair. Um, given I'm not using this at the moment, I'm not too worried. But... Yeah. Yikes. 
Well, at least we don't have to... I shouldn't have done that. We will leave the pump in there, because I will need more of this, I bet. Like... Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Cancel that. Alright, um... I'll let them build that. I'm gonna have to clean that up in between episodes, but that'll be fine. It won't take too long. Um, what I should actually do is just stop that there. Should have thought about that. I thought surely if I dig up enough room it'll be fine, but yeah, whatever. Alright, back at it guys. Uh, in here real quick. Yeah, we're just gonna fill this as full as I can with oxygen. And then we're just gonna come back. Uh, now what I should do is put a fridge right here. And just put like a little, just a, just a little bit of food in there. Um, I should also actually, because she's going to be out there. Stations. Stations. This is going to have to happen soon as well, but I, I want to get Harold back first. Uh, now we want all of these swamp charred hearts that we have. We're gonna come back here because there's a bunch of them in here and they don't want to eat them because they don't want to eat them. What else have we got? Pickled meal? No, nutrient bars. Just sort of get rid of all this junk food that we don't want. <laughs> you know? Um, this can have the nutrient bars, swamp charred heart and muck root. That sounds good to me, and that should work. Uh, once this is full, we can destroy this. Um, and then we will be sending Dear Ellie to space. Yikes. Um, our star map is looking star mappy. Um, but we just have to fly her out to like here because she can do one, two, three tiles away. So that'll be one, two, three. So that's definitely in there. Um, so we can take her out to here, get her to research everything, send her back. Uh, and I will have to keep a close eye on her. But let's check. Ah, beautiful. Uh, now let's put these back in here and put these on priority of one. That's nearly full, I think, 83.2 kilos, and I will just chop the, thank you Meep, you're doing good, you're a bit slow, but you're doing good, alright, uh, plumbing, that actually get, oh, that's not quite far enough. Uh, now I can just put, as a matter of fact, like that, I think, and I can even snip that one there. Let that run backwards until it's past here. That's that. Okay. Make these ones both very quick. And that will be very good well and done. Nice if they swept this up soon, but they won't. What can you do? Um, all right. Well, I'm very pleased with that. Um, we are about ready to start exploring the rest of this part of the star map here. Now, of course, I can't zoom out further on this map. That's unfortunate. Um, now, of course, I will at some point end up 
getting all the way around here um, because fair enough um, I should put a bunker tile right there um, that's also fine I don't care about that um, all right let's head back home real quick yes get that all chopped up that's buried but I don't care they can build that high importance please because it it needs being done uh yes yeah, so tomorrow we will get Ellie to research all this so we can rescue Harold because that's my priority right now and then we can have a look at proper rocketry because this is way too rushed for me um we can do like a proper you know set up a nice little I can cut all of this out, put bunker doors up here. Um, I wonder if... Hmm. I was going to say, I wonder if I can sense the asteroids anymore, because the original telescopes aren't here, I don't think. No, it, it really looks like they're not. So I might see if I can find a mod that has that's just the original telescopes. Um, because that seems kind of important. Stinky. Stinky. Stinky, really. Um undock that suit. Don't know what you're complaining about. And we have a printable, and that will be a fantastic thing to finish on. That's not bad. But then again, that's also pretty good. Um Welcome! Hello! New person. Uh, no, that's Harold's bed. That's Harold's bed. Who's that assigned to? No, that's Harold's bed. So we need to make another bedroom. Where are we going to put it real quick? Uh, bathrooms are down here. So I suppose we're going to put more bedrooms right here. I only need three more. So let's go. One, two, three, four, five, six. A bed. Uh, mesh tile. Mesh tile. Regular tiles for now. And a door. Alright, congratulations. You live here now. This is not your bed. Like, actually, why is that say it's assigned to someone? Uh, it's just glitched out. Anyway, thank you everyone for being here. I hope you've enjoyed it. It's not been super exciting, but tomorrow we will definitely be launching this rocket. Uh, especially because... Can someone... Yeah, Turner's building that. Um, yeah, we'll be getting Ellie out and about and looking at the rest of the world and our universe. Uh, but until then, I'll... you're just going to have to wait. Um, I'll see you then. <laughs> Bye.